Hey guys, welcome back again. This is HK from TechFrapped and here in this video, I'm going to test Xiaomi Redmi Note 5 Pro with official Xiaomi's fast charger and also I'm going to compare it with the stock charger in terms of voltage and current they draw and the rate at which the phone gets charged. So let's start. This is the stock charger, the 5V 2A one and this one is the Xiaomi's fast charger which outputs 5V at 3A, 9V at 2A and 12V at 1.5A. I got this fast charger from Mi Home Store but you can also buy this from Mi.com for 449 rupees. The purchase link for this product is in the description below. And also I am using this volt ammeter to measure the exact voltage and current the phone is drawing from the charging adapters. For the first case, we are using the stock charging adapter with volt ammeter and the micro USB cable connected. Let's start charging the phone and see what happens. As you can see on the lock screen, the status just shows as charging, nothing like fast or rapid charging. The ampere app rating is 1740 mA or 1.7A. If you check the volt ammeter reading, the phone is drawing voltage of 5.3V and 1.9A current with the stock charger. Second case we are using is Xiaomi's fast charger, the 5V 3A, 9V 2A or 12V 1.5A one. And as you can see, the charging status is changed to quick charging now, ampere app rating is 2060mA and the phone is drawing a voltage of 9.17V and 1.2A with the fast charger. So the phone definitely supports fast charging, there's a lot of difference. The stock charger was drawing voltage of around 5.3V and 1.9A, the fast charger is drawing a voltage of 9.2V and 1.24A. Let's just compare the fast charging lasers with the Lumax 2 which officially supports quick charging 2.0. Here I am using the same fast charger with the Lumax 2 too. And as you can see the charging status is charging rapidly at the rate of 3 amperes. If you check the volt ammeter reading, it is drawing voltage of 9.23 volts with 1.9 amperes current. The voltage is almost the same with respect to Redmi Note 5 Pro but it is drawing lot more current here with the Lumax 2. So the Lumax 2 is definitely charging faster than the Redmi Note 5 Pro. Now let's repeat the same with Xiaomi Mi A1 and the fast charger. As you can see the charging status is just charging and the volt ammeter reading is 5.15 volts and 2.03 amperes which is normal charging. Let's move on to the second segment where we charge Redmi Note 5 Pro with stock charger and fast charger for 15 minutes and see how much percentage the phone gets charged. I started charging the phone with fast charger at 3.16pm and the battery percentage was 56% and the volt ammeter reading at 5.58 volts and 2.09 amperes. After 15 minutes, the phone got charged from 56% to 70%. So it's 14% in 15 minutes. With stock charger, the phone got charged from 56 to 69, so there's not much of a difference here. Let's do a full charging test of Redmi Note 5 Pro with fast charger now. I will also be checking the battery temperatures at different time intervals. I started charging the phone at 6.01 pm with 1% of the battery, the charging status is quick charging and initially the phone was drawing a voltage of 5.5 volts and 2 amperes but it slowly picked up and reached 9 volts and 1 amperes in about a minute. After 15 minutes of charge, the phone got charged from 1 to 15%, the battery temperature is 38 degrees, the ampere reading is 2070 mA and the volt ammeter reading is 9.18 volts and 1.19 amperes. After 30 minutes, the phone got charged to 30%, battery temperature is at 40 degrees, ampere reading is at same 2070 mA. After 45 minutes, the phone is at 44%, the battery temperature is at 41 degrees with same ampere stats as before, the volt ammeter reading is also same. After 1 hour, it's 58% with 41 degrees battery temperature, ampere reading of 2080 mA and the same volt ammeter reading. After 1 hour 15 minutes, the phone is at 71% with same battery temperature, ampere reading and almost same volt ammeter reading too. After 1 hour 32 minutes, the phone is at 84%, which is really impressive because Redmi Note 5 Pro has a large 4000mAh battery and most of the times, I usually end up charging the phone from 10 to 85%, so it's only 1 hour 20 minutes to do that. After 84%, the phone charging rate dropped by almost 60%. Previously, the ampere rating was consistent from the start at 2080 mA but now it's 800 mA. The battery temperature is at 42 degrees. The max temperature I noticed was something around 43 degrees at 80%. 
As the phone started charging at a slower rate, the battery temperature is slowly getting down but still the phone is charging the same voltage and current. After 1 hour 41 minutes, the phone hit 90% mark, same ampere reading, the battery temperature is 40 degrees now and it is drawing lesser current from the charging adapter at 0.86 amperes. After 1 hour 53 minutes, the phone is at 95%, ampere reading is 850 mA with a battery temperature of 37 degrees and it is drawing much lesser current at 0.54 amperes. So finally the phone got fully charged to 100% and it took about 2 hours 13 minutes to do that. It's almost 20 to 30 minutes faster than with the stock charger. 2 hours 13 minutes is definitely some time but most of us doesn't always charge our phones to 100%. The phone took 1 hour 32 minutes to charge 84% with fast charger which is really good and I think fast charger is a must have accessory if you got or getting Redmi Note 5 Pro. There are other brand fast chargers too but Xiaomi ones do last for a very long time. I still use my Redmi 1S charger which I got from the very first flash sale. So that's it for now. Do like and subscribe. Thanks for watching and see you soon.